everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Lisa, if you're new around here. Today we're starting the vlog later on in the day because I've got my HelloFresh box. It's just arrived and I'm gonna show you what I'm gonna to make today. So if you're new around here, I've been working with HelloFresh for the last few months and we absolutely love it. I have bought HelloFresh before and now we're working with them, which is amazing. I've also recommended it to all of my family and friends, but if you'd like to try it. Hello, I've been a baby. Yeah, Orlando, you like HelloFresh, don't you? Huh? Do you like this? Do you want to eat this tonight? Yes. Yes? <laughs> so tonight we're going to have the cheese and caramelised onion chicken with garlic mash and stir-fried green mama. beans. So we're going to have that one tonight, but we've also got um, teriyaki beef mince. We've had this one before. It is so good. If you like beef mince, this is the one to try. It's so, so flavoursome. And then this is a new one. We haven't tried this one before. This is an oven-baked risotto with mushrooms and bacon. So that one looks like a nice and easy one to make as well. What I love about HelloFresh is that everything is pretty easy to make. It's very simple. You've got like the step-by-step -step guide on the back, which is ideal. And then you can keep these recipe cards to refer back to in the future, which is fab. I've got so many of these now. So I'm excited. All I need to do now is unpack my box, put it in the fridge, whatever needs to go in the fridge, and that's it. It's so convenient. And it just saves like a big food shop. So you know, like usually you're doing a massive food shop, what I don't like is when I go food shopping, I find it a little bit overwhelming. I'm not really like a planner when it comes to meals. So when I go food shopping, I don't really know what to buy and then I end up like buying the same stuff. So with HelloFresh, it does encourage me to try new meals, to cook new things. So that's what I love about it. It's perfect for date nights as well. They even do lunches as well, which is great. My discount code is COOKWITHLISA. So if you use that code, you'll get 50% off your first box and 35% off your next three boxes, which is amazing. If you haven't tried it yet, then definitely give it a try. But yes, tonight we're gonna to go for the cheese and caramelized onion chicken. Looks gorgeous. The boys are literally gonna be home from school soon. So I'm gonna give it an hour and then I'm gonna start on this. And yeah, I'll show you what it looks like. I'm very excited to eat it. Okay, so that is dinner already. So we've got the cheese and caramelized onion chicken with garlic mash and stir fried green beans looks good i think the boys are gonna love this one so i've just been doing some work this morning now i've just come to sit down in my new my new swing egg chair <laughs> i got this from well qvc asked to send this to me and i just thought oh my god this is amazing it's gonna be perfect outside in the garden because it is meant for the garden but i've put it in the playroom and i just love it in here and they do say on their like video that you can like use it obviously inside or outside I was thinking in the winter I could put some like little fairy lights on here. How cute will that look? So yeah, it's a really, really cute little chair. I'll show you it in a second. But yeah, I've just been working this morning. Um, we have got Mickey coming this afternoon. Well, about 12-ish. Uh, Orlando will be sleeping then. But yeah, he's coming at 12 to come and start doing the floor with Mark. So they're going to do it together. So you need to screed the floor. You've seen in one of my recent videos that we've done all of the underfloor heating. Well, Mark has. So today is like the prep day for the tiles to go down. So I'm very excited about that. Mickey did all of the tiling in our old house and he is amazing. So he's coming again today. And hopefully once the floor is prepped, it won't be too long till we have the tiles put down. So that is really, really good and yeah but anyway let me show you this chair and then um, we'll get on with the rest of the day so this is what it looks like how cute is this and do you know what it actually goes really well with the curtains in this room i've actually got them pulled at the moment so i'll show you them in a second and let me come around here so you can see but can you see they're kind of that like torpy color which goes really well with this kind of torpy color oh my gosh it's so so cute and it like swivels around oh, i love it the boys love it as well because sometimes you know when there's more of us in here it's nice to have another seat in here and you can kind of swivel it around and chat it's kind of been my it's my new chair i sit here all the time so yeah i thought i would show you that because i thought it was super cute just love it and then in the summer when it's like hot again i'm going to take it out in the garden and i think this would look really cute actually you know on the graveled area that we've done, I think that would look so cute there. How is it? Yeah, it's got that smell in it. Like, I have that memory of us, that our old house smell like that. Oh, yeah. And we laid it, do you know what I mean? Yeah. Which reminds me of that. It didn't take very long to pull, did it? It didn't take long at all, yeah. So, like... this has all been screeded now. Yeah. So, that means that this, once it's dry, will be ready for tiling. This is like the self leveling compound we got. Oh, okay. So, this will self level itself, you know what I mean? Right. When you shot okay. it around, it will like be plumb level when you. It will level when it's itself finished, up. Yeah. I thought I'd take you in from this angle because it's a bit different from I know, the door. I usually come from the other door. To, oh yeah, I've only really just realised that. That's why yeah. it's so easy to like see in there. But it's lucky because that one stayed on. Because obviously, oh, yeah. I've got that little fine. bit of battle across there just to make sure I don't go on the parquet floor. Oh my gosh, yeah, I imagine. I know, a bit of a 
But Tyler's coming next week to do it. Yeah, so Mark's just got the tile out so you can have a look at it. This is how big they are. They're it's huge, aren't they? Biggest tile we've ever put in, isn't it? And it's got like this kind of... Really? No, you can't. A bit of a bevelled edge. It goes there. down, doesn't it? Yeah. You know what I mean? It goes like that, doesn't it? Yeah. I didn't realise they were like that. It's so cool. Gives it more like It's hard a... to see in this light because you've obviously got the warmth from that light over there. It's like a bit of a two-tone Just put it on the glass. Effect. Should we take it outside so we can have a look at it properly? There we go, look. So just to give you a bit of a idea. Later. Bit of a flabber. It's so really nice. nice, isn't it? Really lovely. They look well nice. I love them. I like the size. I really like the kind of speckle they've got in them as well. Someone. So they probably won't ever look dirty because they've already got them. Yeah. <laughs> dirty. Yeah, Do you know what I mean? Yeah. 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 yeah well, I kind of like that look, don't you? I really love it. Yeah. But it looks like worn, doesn't it? It looks like a like a pretend stone, I suppose. And they're porcelain, aren't they? They are porcelain. So they don't like faff of ceiling them, have you? No, that's it. Orlando's just having a snack, aren't you, Poppet? Oh, strawberries. strawberries, yummy. And whilst we're in here, we thought that what we would do, we're not changing the sofas yet, but we just wanted to have a little jig about and see whether like a two-seater sofa would go nicely here. So Mark's gonna bring the two-seater sofa in from the playroom yep. and then we're gonna take this bit off so it looks like it's kind of a long sofa. Up. Yeah. That's like a three seater, isn't it? Yeah, but it just gives us an idea then, because this is the part that I'm concerned about the most. So I want to see like how much extra down. space it will give us. Because mm. we are going to move that radiator, aren't we? Over today? The radiator is going to move eventually, and we're going to get one that goes underneath here. That'd be well nice. So then we can kind of push the sofa all the way back. Yeah. I want like a floor lamp there. Do you know what I mean? I think you ain't got one, No. This feels bigger now. Like that. Yeah, I was looking back at our old um, living room the other day, and when we did the built ins, I really liked them being white, so now I feel like these should be white. So that's the plan. And then we've got a new light coming here, like a big black. It's not black actually, it's like an antique brassy colour. And then another like pendant light to go there. You right, darling? What are you doing? Is that yours, is it? Yeah, it's my, it's my trunk. You're putting it in your pocket? Jesus, it's my trunk. Wow. Right, so we've got the sofa in here now. I don't know if, I don't think that looks right. Do you know what I mean? I feel like it looks better with a corner sofa. Because it's not really opened it up that much, has it? What do you guys think? Do you think we're, it's be we're better off having a corner sofa like we've currently got? We don't want it being too long this way, that's all, but we can have it longer that way. As you walk in now, obviously you've got that. Hello! Vista. Mm. I think this just doesn't look right. It looks weird going past that wall, doesn't it? But like, you can always have like a little, a table behind it. So it kind of defers. No, I don't mean like that. Or if you put the pillar there for a minute, can you put the, mm. this thing here? I mean. Then that feels like it's meant to be like yeah, that. Do you know what I mean? It kind of makes it look better, doesn't it? It definitely looks better like that. And then that, those over there are not going to be there. Obviously these two would match as well. No. Oh yeah. Smart, I don't know now. I don't know. I think it's just because it's looking a lot, a lot is going on over here. The picture will have to go. It won't go like that. The thing is, if you, if you no, don't go. three seater it makes it even more room. You'd have a three and a two, couldn't you? Yeah. I you might well have a four in you because it's like a long wall, aren't you? Mm. You've got Christmas and things, what's that people know? I don't know. I'm not really sure. I'm not 100% on it. Yeah, it doesn't look this, terrible. This would come right over it as well, wouldn't it? Like in the middle, surely, like that. Yeah, and the rug will come over. That, this rug will come this way. Sometimes it's nice to have a bit of change. I just feel, room. yeah, but I feel like that is making the room feel smaller when you look at it from here. Because obviously because it's like, used to you've got a huge why. telly, big sofa, like chunky yeah, there. It makes it more like a room, doesn't it? It's a 50-50, isn't it? Yeah, but I feel like it it needs to be either a chair over there or or not a sofa. I just don't think the sofa looks right. Even though like this goes like that, I feel like it's just more of a statement like that. This long bit. Do you know what I mean? Where have you got like a little bit hanging out, it just looks yeah. like it's silly. I think maybe a straight four and a chair. And a chair. Mm. You're looking at it not finished, which is always hard to do, isn't it? Yeah. Too but it's good to get an idea of how it can look. Are you comfy there? 
You could have a little snooze, are you? A little sleep? I think the straight four yeah. is definitely the shower. But one day we won't even have the dining room set in here. So then I don't know what we'll do again. We'll have to reconfigure again, maybe. <laughs> do you know what we should do? We should just, I'm not going, I think we should just leave it in here for now. Don't put it back. No. Oh, no, 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 no. I don't mean forever. I mean just for like one night. Leave it in here tonight. Yeah, but we, to we know we can see the telly. No, 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 I'm not talking about it's that. It's all fine. I'm just talking about like a night feeling. Funny. <laughs> do you know what I mean? We're either going to do it or we're not. Do don't worry about it. Oh, there. you're funny. You are. I'm being serious. I know I'm comfy here because I used to have the chair over here, yeah, so I don't mind. Right. It is nice when you've got the fire on, though. Yes. It's like cosy there. Your feet up, warm your feet. Yeah. I like it. I'm putting myself out there. I'm going on a limb. I'm change. warm. I'm warming, warming to it. Again now. Yeah, I am warming to it. I think it'd be really nice. I just the I think the rug is throwing me off yeah, at the minute because it's, it's like squishy, so over it? there. And then we need to get rid of these chairs. So I just pull the rug out or not? No, I can't bother with that today. This is a cute little vista, actually. This is cute here. I think it looks really, really good. So we're making a decision, are we? Is this going to be where the sofa is going to be? I, I would like. I think it would look really smart, actually. Mm, I think it would be nice. You just got to envision it with not the sofa, so I mean, that's. I trick. do like how you feel like more connected. It's like cozy. But then it's its own little space at the same time. Yeah. Right. So Lisa's thinking that this painting's got to go. We've got to move it, but. We're going to put our, is it Laura Ashley mirror, I think, the white one from our bedroom? Mm -hmm. Oh, here it is. This one, I've been, well, I didn't know where else to put it. But I feel like that, this It could look nice there, to be fair. And also, because that light is like round, it's like roundy, roundy. I think it could look pretty smart, though. See, I think that looks better already. It's amazing how you move a few things around. That, that changes it, doesn't it? Looks so much better yeah, it looks smart, actually. Yeah, I like it. it looks good. Okay, so we have found a place for the gold picture. Right here, there was a hook right there, waiting right. for it. What the hell? How good is that? Actually, goes really well with the window. We need to open the door so I can go outside. But that's quite a cute little vista as you come in the door now. I like it. That's cute. We need to paint it in here. This is what it looks Today. like. Yeah, you can start painting. <laughs> Get the paintbrush out, babe. But yeah, no, I like that. And there was a hook on the wall here, so it's perfect. Meant to, be. Meant to be. I love the window like that and then there. Yeah, that's so cute. I'll put a little paper in there. I know, why'd you do that it's for? It's style, isn't it? <laughs> I mean... Is that not style? No, it's not really. Move the but yeah, I'm thinking for this area in the future, I want to do um, terracotta tiles. You know, like they look like outside ones, they look a bit rustic. Perfect spot for yeah. it, beautiful. And then we need to paint this the same colour as this one. You can see actually here. That is slightly more warmer. It's like magnolia, I would say. But yeah, need to paint that. Give it a little spruce up. Mummy's gonna shut the door now. Yeah. Mummy's gonna shut the door. Yeah. Are you in? Hey, bye bye. Cute. Yeah. See it through there. So we've done some more shimmying around because Mark wanted to get the chairs out of here. And this is how it looks. Space. We've just moved this into the middle. Obviously, we need a bigger rug for sure. But I'm quite happy with that. Aren't you? Like, Looks I mean, nice. It feels like this is now the lounge, if that makes yeah. sense. Christmas tree still got a place there. Lots of people say, why don't you put chairs here? We like to keep this open for the tree. <laughs> Look, we, yeah, tree area. It's reserved for the Christmas tree, even though it's only once a year. It's it needs to have its space. Also. Yeah, it's up for ages, isn't it? Should we go to the trampoline park? Go bouncy, bouncy. No, we're going in the orange line. Okay, <laughs> he has no idea, but we're going to a trampoline park. And I thought we'd just go there. Let's go. Mummy, wear that sock. Yeah, I'm going to wear those socks. Hmm? I'm going to wear those socks too. Thank you. Are you excited? Yes. Yes. So we've just got back from the trampoline park, haven't we, Landy? He didn't want to leave, of course he didn't want to leave. He had the best time. So Orlando hasn't been to the trampoline park, I don't think. I don't know whether it was like Vinny's birthday before lockdown. Me 
done. Thank you, you're done, good boy. So a long time ago, so he was the, in his element. It was just nice to take him somewhere different. It was literally a last minute decision this morning. Even though the weather's nice, I was thinking, what can I do with him today? That's just a bit different, like what we don't usually do. And I thought that was a perfect place because they do like um, mini mornings for like younger ones. So there's only like under fives, I think it is. Really good, it wasn't too busy. And he literally bounced on the trampoline the whole time we were there. So yeah, he had a really lovely time. I did film some clips in there, but as you can see, it's basically all on my phone because I didn't take my camera in there. I didn't want to like film the whole time I was in there. I just wanted him to have a good time. So yeah, that's all I've been doing this morning. I need to do some editing now. And also when he goes down for his nap, finish some work emails and like catch up and stuff. I really need to get myself organized this week. I've got so much organised I want to do, like go through the cupboards and the drawers in the house. So that is something I need to do. So keep reminding me, Lisa, you're going to do some organising because uh, if I film it, then it will make me do it. <laughs> Whereas like usually I just keep putting it off all the time. Um, but yeah, my hair feels so good actually. Since I've had it coloured, like it probably doesn't look great at the moment because I've been like sweaty all morning. <laughs> um, but my hair feels so good since I've had it coloured. And they used a different product on my hair. You would have seen it in the, the hair video. And I think it's definitely something to do with that. It's made my hair feel and look shinier as well. So I'm really pleased with that. My eyebrows as well, we're on day six now. So this is what my eyebrows are looking like. This is day six. So we're at the stage now where they're going to start to like flake a little bit, and maybe peel away, I don't want them to go. I really love the color of them as they are now. I don't really want them to lighten up, but apparently the next stage they will like go really light and fade. So I'm like, oh, and then they like the pigment comes back again. So I'm hoping that it doesn't fade too much because I think I've been really lucky with the way they peeled so far. I also need to get um, a package. I think we've got a package at the door. So let me just grab that a sec. So I've just gone to the door and opened the post that I've, that's arrived. So I thought I'd show you what I've got. It's a little bit of a PR unboxing. So these bits have been sent to me. This hasn't though. So I bought this for the kids. So you know the boys love cricket. Mark um, said that we should get them some cricket t-shirts because the boys always wear their like white cricket t-shirts all the time. But this is a, like an England replica uh, cricket t-shirt. So we've got them that. It's by New Balance, I think. How cute is that? Oh my god, they're absolutely gonna love it. That is so, so cute. So I've got one for Vinny, and I've also got one for Renzo. So I'm hoping that the sizing is gonna fit. They don't look much different, actually. That one looks a lot shorter, actually, doesn't it? So fingers crossed those fit. That's for Vinny and Renzo. And then I got sent some really cute robes from a place called Happy Place. Now, I think these are only shipping in America at the moment, but I think they are trying to ship, like, internationally. So they sent me some robes. Alex Michael May wears these all the time and I was like oh my gosh I need to buy one. So I messaged them to see if they shipped to the UK. They said they didn't but they really wanted to send me one and I'm going to do some like um, like an interview with them like for their blog. So um, they, they obviously sent me a robe and oh my god I'm so pleased. How exciting. What size did I get now? I think I got a medium. So it's basically like oh is this a robe? This is not a robe. This is a blanket. Oh my god look at this. <gasps> like a big waffle blanket that is amazing wow so this is what i've got very excited about that so so nice feels so good so yeah i've got that and then they've also sent me uh, a unisex one so this is more in a linen fabric in like a khaki green how gorgeous oh i love that that is so so nice the quality feels amazing. This feels so good, this t-shirt. Oh my God, it's so soft. Wow, that is so soft. Yes, I got that from Happy Place, which is beautiful. Thank you to Happy Place for that. I also got this Trish McAvoy Dramatic Lash Mascara. So this is new in. Apparently this formula delivers drama in length, thickness and separation. So we shall see. It's got conditioning ingredients. So yeah, I'll let you know how that goes because I'm loving different mascaras at the moment and I'm excited to try that one. Yeah, those are all of the bits that I got this morning. What I'm going to do now is I'm going to tidy up, tidy all this mess up, do some editing and that's about it really. So I think I'm going to leave the vlog there. Thank you so, so much for watching. Don't forget to check out the HelloFresh code. I will leave it down below. Cook with Lisa and you'll get 50% off your first box and then 35% off your next three boxes, which is amazing. So thank you so much for watching and I will see you all very, very soon. Bye guys.